34 weeks and four days today and I feel like this baby has dropped so I want to know what you guys think when I show you my belly but I'm gonna go ahead and start off with symptoms this week I have talked about this so much throughout this whole pregnancy but this baby I swear never stops hiccuping like it has the hiccups a minimum of three times a day it has the hiccups so often I remember all of my other kids having hiccups but I never remember any of them having the hiccups like this much like geez child like what are you are you like drinking the amniotic fluid I don't know at first it was like super cute you know and you're just like oh look at the little hiccups and now it's just like all the time and I'm like child do you ever not have the hiccups <laughs> also I've been having so many Braxton Hicks contractions especially at nighttime I've noticed that they start to pick up more so I don't know I sort of have a feeling and I've had a lot of other people tell me this too I have a feeling that I'm not going to I don't know and I don't want to jinx myself I'm probably just gonna be completely wrong with this but I just kind of have a feeling that I'm not going to go like super overdue this time or like overdue at all maybe I'm crossing my fingers that I could have like a 39 weeker like that would be a nice change right the twins were 38 weeks Lilia was 40 weeks Landon was 41 weeks so I need like a 39 weeker in there somewhere right like that would just like even things out 39 weeks would be good for me so I'm kind of hoping that I can go like just a little teeny bit like before for my due date this time. Also this week I have been having constant, constant heartburn and like I don't know if it's like acid reflux too, I don't really know what the difference is but I just have this constant, what I know as like heartburn all the time constantly I've been like living off of Tums and it seems like Tums helps whenever I do take it but it doesn't help for longer than I don't know maybe a couple hours I've just been having so much heartburn and it's been just killing me it is so frustrating to deal with that much heartburn all the time it's so annoying and also the main thing this week is I've been having so many headaches and I've talked about this throughout my whole pregnancy how many headaches I've really had I just feel like this whole pregnancy has been a headache like I just have so many headaches with this pregnancy and I've I don't remember ever getting this many headaches with any of my others and I've been noticing this last week specifically it's been very consistent in terms of like the timing of it so around three to four o'clock every day I get this like pounding headache there was one day where I had a headache all day long from the second I woke up to the second that I went to bed it was all day long and I was so miserable and I had the heartburn oh I was just feeling like crap I have a midwife appointment on Monday so so of course I always talk about all the stuff with her too and make sure that she knows how I'm feeling so yeah I am excited about that because I think after this one I will be 35 weeks so then I'll probably have another appointment two weeks after that and then I'm gonna be going to the one week appointment so oh that's exciting and she did talk about wanting to start me on I'm not sure exactly what this is called but it's some kind of like herbal supplement and it's called like 5w if you google it with pregnancy it'll probably come up if I am remembering correctly she had me start taking it at the very end of my pregnancy with Landon, but she wants me to start taking it at 35 weeks this time, or 36 weeks, I can't remember which one she said, in hopes to make sure that I don't go like super overdue this pregnancy because I did last time with Landon. So she did mention that we might try that this time, so I'm gonna definitely look into that, and I'm sure I'll be talking to her more about that on Monday when I see her. So other than that, I just feel like this baby has dropped so low. Like there was one day, I just feel like this baby out of nowhere was so low. It's like normally I can feel the butt up in my ribs, and maybe it just changed position, so that's definitely a possibility as well, but where I used to fill the butt, it's now empty. There's like no baby there at all. The baby's like completely, like completely dropped like a good few inches and the butt, and I can pretty much tell like what I'm, what body part I'm feeling um, most of the time and the butt like dropped significantly. So like where it was, it like literally went down which made my stomach like actually look lower. So um, different times of day, it will fill like in a different, position if that makes sense because obviously the baby's moving all the time so depending on what position the baby's in that's gonna make your stomach look a little bit different too so throughout the day I feel like the baby like gravity takes over and the baby just like drops <laughs> like this morning I woke up and the baby was up high again but now as I've been walking throughout the day I feel like it's starting to get a little bit lower I don't know let me let me know what you guys think I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys my 34 week ba belly belly what am I saying ba belly <laughs> so here is what the shirt on maybe I should take this off huh so you guys with the shirt on And I don't know if you guys can really tell what I'm talking about, but like normally I felt the baby like way up here And so now like literally there's nothing up here. Sorry. There's a hole in my shirt apparently 
there's like nothing up here until right here and then you can feel like the baby's bottom is right here and then the head is down here so I don't know let me, let me know what you guys think but here's the shirt up and again I still haven't been able to find the pink one that seems to be a little bit like more accurate but we'll go ahead and use this one for today it looks like I'm at 43, like perfectly at 43. Oh, and also this week, before I forget, I took my second round of maternity pictures. I talked about this in one of my other videos, so if you don't remember, I took maternity pictures with a different photographer, kind of like for fun, and then this is the actual maternity session that I had like scheduled, so I haven't gotten all of those back yet. I'm so excited to see how they turn out because she did post a couple like sneak peek ones, and they look Gorgeous, so I'm so excited and the photographer is really well known around here And I will put her information down below and you can find her website And then there's a couple sneak peeks on her Instagram of us I'm so excited to see how they turn out and hopefully she'll post them all So maybe if you go follow her on Instagram and her fa her Facebook and stuff like that You can get a preview of those before I post them But once I get all of them in I'm definitely gonna post like a full-on montage of all of the maternity pictures from this like whole pregnancy not just that session just like of, of both of them So as soon as I get those you can definitely expect that for one of my videos and oh the other thing that I should have wrote this in my symptoms I just randomly thought about this though. I've been uh, organizing like crazy like I don't know what has gotten into me I just feel the need to clean everything like nesting has definitely been kicking in I organized my whole pantry which I'm going to be doing like a pantry storage tour I guess or like I don't know a pantry some something along those lines because I'm so proud of how it looks it like, turned out so beautiful and so now we're working on the house I've just been going around this entire house cleaning everything picking up everything and like going through things and like throwing things away that we don't use anymore and just really like been super like <laughs> I don't know nesting I just I think it's just nesting kicking in I don't know that's really just about it this week Make sure you follow me on Facebook, Snapchat, and Instagram. I'll have those links down below. And other than that, I will talk to you guys on Monday for our next video. Bye. It's too bad. We're leaving the park. We had two out of three crying a minute ago.